know, the, the one of the reasons we built this school is our our old middle school, or our current middle school, I should say, uh, was built for 550 students, and we currently house over 700 students there. So square footage-wise, I, I actually don't know the square footage off the top of my head, but this building is 162,000 square feet and will house three grades instead of two, sixth, seventh, and eighth. Um, and really, the capacity in this building is more towards that 13, 1400 student capacity, which leaves us room. Our, our enrollment studies show that we're going to grow to about 5,000 to 5,100 students by 2021. This building will allow us to grow without having to build again. People forget we have seventh and eighth grade athletics, and we have two teams at almost every sport. So when you look at how much room and how much space we need for our kids to participate in those sports, this facility will allow us to have practice right after school for students. Right now it's kind of some people get to practice right after school and others have to come back. Um, this will allow us to have a lot of our teams immediately after school and not have that time where maybe kids are out doing other things. So. Well here you've got your main circulation desk area and behind it will be some computers and then some soft seating for the kids. So some comfortable chairs, couches that will face out through the windows where they can sit and read. On the left hand side you can see the boxes in the floor for the electrical and that's all uh, a computer lab. The project's due to be done. The original due date was May 26th and we actually are on schedule to finish May 24th. So that is the inside of the building. Um, so the building itself and that's to get temporary occupancy uh, for the building. The outside of the building there's going to can, going to still need to be some work done as far as sidewalks, paving, some other things, and we're hoping that that's done by early July.